If I combine sepia color with the speckling technique, I can create some splashes or wet matte effects on the front of armor. To break the shape more, I also speckle the pigment on the glasses area and because of the dark color, I take a lighter earth tone to fix it. Other exposed areas to heavy matte weathering like the rear plate are worked as well. For instance, let's imagine here that the Sherman went through a very muddy road. On the upper parts, I like also to apply small quantities of pigments, but I prefer to make it only on the front areas. These tiny recesses next to the crew hatches created by the Sherman armor design are the perfect candidates to create some heavy dust accumulated after some weeks of operation.